This is Project Zelko. Zelos. No. Welcome everybody to Tales of Symphonia, Project Zelko, Part 58. I'm Cal's Crazy, and I'm with my Tales trainer, Zelos 1826. Nice. In the last That's part, me. we were inside the ice dungeon, and we got an ice pact with an ice woman, and then lightning came down and blew up, like, Perseus' hometown. Yep. But, but we found this mythos, or a mythos, at least, uh, yeah. who happens to be the only survivor. What a coincidence. And um, mm. let's go talk to the dwarf who lives next door. All right, let's do it. Oh, but there's still... Kendama and Mythos. What's going on, everybody? Ah, we were just playing with Genius Kendama, but it's really hard. Oh, oh. could I try were to? We, though? <laughs> oh, of course, here. Thanks. Hiya. Wow, Mythos, you're good. Well, good at playing was the Genius Kendama, Kendama invented by Havels or something? It's okay, if I try it too? Sure. Here I go, hi-ya! Ya! Ta-ha! Ta-ya! Ta-ya! Uh-oh, it's going to hit the professor again! Look out! What? The Kendama just changed directions! Right towards Zelos! Head! <laughs> Ow! Why are Kendamas raining on me? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's strange. I wonder if it was Colette's power. Strange things happen sometimes, don't they? But I'm glad Rain wasn't hurt. Yeah, I'm much more happy that it hit Zealous. What? Wow! So I don't matter? Exactly! No. I need to hug him. He's so cute. No, no, no. He's so sad. <laughs> All right, Mr. Elf. All right. Tell us things. You got a cutscene or a lot of talking coming up. That is not voice acted. I was a craftsman who worked for Crucius. So, you're on the side of the angels? Yargasil? You know Lloyd Yargasil? You know him? Because of him, Sylvan and Tethia were twisted into all the worlds that fight for each other's mana. Dot, dot, dot. That's a Crucius crystal. I see. You must be the chosen of the declining world. This may be fate. What happened to Ozette was my fault. What do you mean? I came to hate the work I did. It was indirectly taking people's lives. I ran from Crucis and hid myself in Ozette. But I was found by a design named Roydell. He ordered me to create a Crucis crystal in exchange for my life. So that means that the research on Pariza was organized by Rodell and the Pope, who then had you and Kate carry it out. Right. Mm. Rodell, while at design in service of Crucis, was also planning to revolt against Crucis. Because I supported him in that, Lord Yargasil grew angry, and he, he destroyed the town of Ozette, which had protected me. So, this is how Persea, this girl who reflects my distant memories, this is how she was caught up in this. This is terrible beyond words, but yet we are using so many words. <laughs> I am sorry, I can never apologize enough, but apologizing is all I can do now. My time will not come back. The people of the village and daddy will not come back. Daddy? 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 <laughs> Prusea, I'm sorry. Don't apologize. Even if you apologize, I can't forgive you right now. Da, da, da. Daddy? Prusea, I believe your great loss has been great. But please, do not lose yourself as well. Da, da, da. I can understand Perseus' feelings a little. Some things never come back. Even if he apologizes, even if you want to forgive, you can't control those feelings. Not being forgiven, that may be the punishment. 
I don't think that's right. Forgiving or not forgiving isn't a punishment. I can't really explain it well, but... Ah! Well, anyways, let's not get into a philosophical discussion right now. Perseia doesn't need to force herself to forgive him or anything. Let's just think about what we can do now. Yes, you're right. As for me, I think we should take this opportunity to ask Alteza all he knows about Crucius. We currently don't have enough information, wouldn't you agree? Yeah, Perseia. Would you rather wait here? No. I'll listen as well. So inside we go, yes, to continue mm -hmm. the discussion. More talking. Fun. <laughs> uh, downstairs. Let's be friends. And secret of oh, oh that. There's, there's two cutscenes there. Why is there a gnome here? Oh, talk to him, yes. Huh? You people? You see my big brother? What the? What are you talking about? My big brother ain't back from... So I'm looking for him. Actually, your brother has already gone home. Really? 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 Now really? that they're probably looking for you, you should go back home. Really? I'm going home! Yep. Oh, okay, he went home. Secret of Wee 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 all the way home. Oh, okay. Sure. Do you have business with me? Can you tell us about Crucius? It'll be a long story. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's okay. Here we go. Good thing we just started the video. <laughs> Crucis is an organization made up almost entirely of half-elves. There are a large number of dwarves besides me involved as well. So, there are other dwarves besides you and my dad? Oh, I should hope so. There are objectives. Are their objectives are to begin the age of half elves and the revival of Martel. For that purpose, they make use of the Church of Martel and try to fuse the Chosen with Martel's consciousness. But if that's true, then why do the designs try to kill the Chosen? X spheres and Crucis crystals awaken when stimulated by people's fear and suffering. Also, by their combat instincts. That is why the designs disrupt the declining world. In order to facilitate the angel transformation, they deliberately put the Chosen in danger. However, they would not take her life. It must be a design that portrayed Crucis like Rodel, a member of the Renegades. Rodel, what is he scheming? The revival of Mana Cannon. Oh, the Mana Cannon. He obtained the plans to the Mana Cannon somehow and is constructing it in Silverwind. But don't worry, there's a very small, tiny hole in the Mana Cannon. And if you fly with your fl your wonderful ships, you can fly into it and then use R2D2 to find the precise point and then you can shoot it you and you win. Can you fucking not? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about right now? And I'm like, oh, he's fucking referencing Star Wars. Are you serious? I thought you didn't like Star Wars, dude. I don't, but this sounds just as stupid as it. <laughs> you're, you're. <laughs> the man in canon is clearly the Death Star. <laughs> Not even close. <laughs> he's also the master of his own ranch. Ooh, a ranch. It's likely he's using his captives in the construction of the cannon. Once it's complete, he'll probably intend to build his own empire. The Empire Strikes Back. How oh can my he make God. everyone suffer for such a thing? Space show is stupid. <laughs> Say then, is it true that Yargasil made two worlds? Well. Yargasil? Yeah, Yargasil. What'd you say? <laughs> Yeah, like Vagisil, Yargasil. I no, I no, stop. <laughs> God damn it. Well, that's how I heard it. That's that he anchored the two worlds, which are never, which are never to come in contact, via former manor links, and placed the great seed in the center, between them to guard it. The great seed. Where have I heard that before? It comes up in the stories of the hero, Mythos. That's what people called the soul of Mythos, who died on the holy ground of Carl Land. Carl Land. 
I don't know. Sure. After, after the close of the ancient war. Wait a minute. That's true. But... Why does the same legend of Mythos from Silverland also exist over here? I've been wondering about this for a while now. There are two holy grounds of Carl Land. Two towers of salvation. Two towers? What? Are we into the Lord of the Rings now? <sighs> and now, the legend of Mythos is the same too? It seems it's possible to travel between the two worlds at their poles. I don't know where those poles would be, but perhaps that person we know as Mythos used that to travel between the worlds. Bipolar, yes, that's it. Isn't that a mental condition? <laughs> Being <laughs> bipolar? <laughs> Professor, what is it? This is my theory. Perhaps the ancient war was in fact a war between Tethia and Silverwind. Ooh. Ooh. And the hero Mythos arranged the truce that ended the war. But that's just a theory. A game A theory. game theory. <laughs> and then, so that would be why the legend of Mythos exists in both worlds. Yes. And if we assume that one of the two poles is the holy ground of Carl Land, then we can under <laughs> understand the meaning of existence. Of the existence of two holy grounds. That's the door between the two worlds. Yes, Carl that makes Land. sense. I've heard many ideas regarding the bipolar structure of the worlds, but yours works from a logical standpoint. What logical. other ideas have there been? There is a legend passed down in Altamera about something called the Otherworldly Gate. Some say that is a pole. Mm -hmm. The Otherworldly Gate? I have a pole at home I ride up and down, but I, I don't know about it. <laughs> what? <laughs> no! God damn it! <laughs> Rule 34, weighing on a stripper pole. <laughs> I, I don't know if that's a thing, but I'm sure Rule 34, rain is a thing somewhere. <laughs> so, oh what God. is the great seed? The great um, seed is when you bend over and I thrust and I thrust. <laughs> <laughs> No! What the fuck? <laughs> Why am I fucking either. surprised now? Oh but my Lord god. But Lord Yajasil said that it was more important than his life. I can't wrap my head around all this stuff at once. You must be tired by now. Why don't you go rest here for the night? Mythos, right? If you don't have anywhere else to go, you should stay here at my place for a while. I wouldn't. I wouldn't, I wouldn't touch <laughs> you. Sure nothing. nothing. <laughs> I wouldn't touch you. Nothing. Oh, you know. Fuck. You need to stay, here. <laughs> you know, I... stay at my place. Are you, are you sure that's okay? I'm a half elf. The only ones living here are Tabitha, who I made, and me, a dwarf. You made Tabitha? Yes, Tabitha is an automated doll, so having a half elf here isn't a problem at all. Tabitha is a doll? Well, yeah, she's clearly a sex toy. <laughs> oh, duh. Okay. We'll stay here too for the night. Yes, okay. Is that okay with you, Parisa? Please, don't worry about me. Then, I shall prepare dinner. Good job. Ooh, dinner. Then, tonight, Genius and Rain will be here too, dinner. right? Yeah. Let's play together. You're the first half-elf friend I've had. You'll be my friend? Of course! Thank um, you. Oh, duh. <laughs> Why would he not be your friend? <laughs> Let's be friends. We can make it together. Do, do, do. It's morning time. I think. Maybe. Up. 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 <laughs> Um, does, does somebody need some up. Viagra? Uh, are, they trying to, are they trying to get it up? <laughs> up! Lord, wake up! <laughs> the professor's gone! Oh no! Uh oh. 
What? <clears throat> what are you talking about? It seems Wayne left a note saying she had something she wanted to investigate and left. Shortly before dawn, I saw a weird headed south. Perhaps that was Wayne. South? So in the direction of Altamira? Now that you mention it, Her Highness was acting just a bit strange yesterday. She was going on and on about otherworldly gate and how she missed her pole. <laughs> oh, duh. What should we do about it, Lloyd? I'm worried about her being by herself. Let's go find her. It's not good for us to be separated right now. Uh, um, will you take me with you? What are you talking about? It's dangerous. I know that, but I, I'm worried about her. There are monsters all over Tethia right now. This is the first time I've met another half-elf besides me, so I, I want her to be okay. Alright, come on. Or, no, it's just too dangerous. Does this choice actually matter? I think he goes with you regardless. Okay. Well, we'll say okay. All right, come on. Thank you, Lloyd. Don't worry about it. Any friend of genius is a friend of mine. I think that just affects uh, friendship. Okay, let's do our best, genius. Mythos, thank you. Genius, let him ride on your reheart. <laughs> wow. What if he doesn't swing that way? Okay. Uh, you know what? I don't think you'll care. Wait. This is for Parisa. A key quest? Well? It's hardly enough to call it an apology. But I went ahead and made one. You're right. Cause it's too late to apologize. Uh, no. It will be more reliable than that makeshift one she has now. Parisa, let's accept it. Okay. Yes. yes We've accepted it. Why do yes, we keep losing mother. party members? <laughs> and now we've lost the best party member. You know, the healer. <laughs> well, you need to go south. Where? South, huh? We need to go south. Oh my god, there's a gigantic from. penis sticking out of the wall. The that's the Tower of Salvation. Mm, yeah, I'm sure it will be Yeah, salvation. it's a giant penis. Sure, why not? Okay. You're weird. <laughs> okay, we're going south. Where south? I think it's it's on an island. Maybe it's not south. Oh. Maybe well. it is further south. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going south. I'm going south, but I'm about to head off Nushi the edge of the map. Nushi and Mythos. I'm about to head off the edge of the map. Uh, go. To, um, no, you're fine. Go to your go west a little bit. Go west. It's on an go. island. Look around on all the islands. Okay, there's nothing west. That's for sure. There's no okay, islands so here. Go south a little bit. South is north okay, now. now. Now I'm in the north. This doesn't You're make any fine. sense. fine. Just go east You a either bit. know where it is or you don't. <laughs> Off the top of my head, no, I don't. Oh god, we're really lost. Is it in the ice islands? It's on an island in the water. Which one? There's a million of them. Oh my god. Do you it's even not... have a general guess? <laughs> it's close Is it that? to... I... No. No? It's not no, that? No, that's not a... That is, um... That was the renegade base, remember? Oh. Okay, is it that? I see a, I see a Nushi stone. Or something. There is a... That is a... Why is there a Nushi stone on the out here by itself. That's a little weird, isn't it? I don't know. I can't even land here. Okay, then, um... Hold the fuck up. Where are you? I don't know, but I can't even land there. Oh, okay, now I can. Okay, go south. Go Long okay. mode can now be used by a gargantua disquit in the Flanor Subcomforts. Uh, okay. What the hell does that mean? You can use Nushi now. Okay. But you don't need Nushi anymore. <laughs> you can walk. Yeah, I can. Go south. 
You are going, like, west. Turn south, please. I'm trying to turn south. You keep saying south, but we're not actually going south. Well, we've, we've gone all the way around the world now. We've... Okay, stop. Okay. Keep going south a little bit. A little bit. Okay, a little bit. There's, like, a thing here. That is Altamira. That is not where we're going. Okay. It's just south of that, I do believe. Just south of Altamira. There should be an island with, like, pillars on it that you're looking for. I see islands. I do not see pillars. And this is not an island. is this island a hold up? This is not an island anymore. There is no longer an island here. You said just south of it? That is incorrect. There are no pillars on any island just south of there. Hold on, let me look. God damn it. I don't know where you even are on the map right now. I don't I know, but it. we're all the way back to the big penis tower. <laughs> big penis tower? How did we get back there already? I don't know. We went all the way around the world, that's how. <laughs> where the fuck was that island? You kept saying south, and the more south you go, you eventually be north. <laughs> um, hang on, I'm looking chill. This is what happens when you ask for the worst person that has a sense of direction oh, to, to lead you. You know what? <laughs> you fly around and look for it for your fucking self. I'm done. Um, we I'd have just as much guessing. <laughs> exactly. I don't think I've ever been you don't here. need me. You don't need well, me. Well, because you're supposed to know. You're supposed to know. I do know. But you don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't think I've ever been here. That's all Tamira. No, you have not been there yet. Okay, isn't that where they said she was going? You don't... I don't think you need to be here. Didn't but you can go in there and ask going? around for her. I'm almost sure they said she was going here. Okay, then go. Well, if you don't know where we're going, we might as well go in here. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm going to wait here. <gasps> What's up? Won't say why, huh? Well, if you don't want to talk about it, that's your business. Lloyd, let him do what he wants. All right, we'll catch you on the way out. He doesn't want to come inside. That's a little strange. That's a little sus. Yeah, it is sus. It's very sus. Yeah, you can talk to people here. They'll give you tips about where the gate is, I think. Okay. But I shouldn't need tips. I should... You're my tip. I... <laughs> no, you're supposed to give me the tip. Oh, wow. Why aren't you talking to people? The Element Railway will now depart. Where the hell are you going? Uh, we can go to an amusement park, or we Why can go to the Why are you not talking to people? Do we want to go to the amusement park, or the little... No, you don't want to go company? anywhere. Okay, well... You need you to talk to people. Well, I shouldn't need to talk to people. I'm oh my god. I'm for you to remember. <laughs> Ultimately, is divided into several areas. <laughs> to get to each area, use the elemental railway to the left. Okay, well, that doesn't help me either. I don't know if she's the one you're looking for, but there was a woman here who was looking for something called the Otherworldly Gate. I wonder where she went. Yeah, me too. If only somebody knew. <laughs> Welcome. Aren't you one of our guests staying at this hotel? No, I'm not, apparently. You're looking for someone named Miss Wayne, I see? If I find out anything, I'll be sure to let you know. Well, thanks. Nobody knows anything. You're looking for someone? I haven't seen her. Do you even know who knows the answer? Hello? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna ignore you. But you're not doing anything! <laughs> like you, I you're... know, I'm trying to look this up! <laughs> like, you're being angry as if I'm not listening to what you're telling me. I am. You're just not telling me I can't tell where you are anything. if you're not on the map. First that... of all. Okay, well that doesn't help. I know you're looking for someone, but you far too many people pass by here. I can't remember them all. I'm sorry, I can't help you. Okay, I have talked to everybody in this town now. Nobody knows anything. They all okay. are dumb. Then go outside. <sighs> and what? We're just gonna hey, continue dude. to guess?
Right there. There it is. Where? Where? There it where? was. Turn left. Turn where? Back. Where? Go, go back. You just passed it. Turn around. There's she in Mythos. <laughs> oh my god, Nushi's on the plane? What's his Nushi. name? <laughs> He's called Nushi. He's Nushi. <laughs> yeah, Nushi doesn't like the, all this plane stuff either. Nushi! That's the name of the firstborn on this world. What? Wow. Really? That's how the story goes anyways. Guarded by mana, Nushi will eventually evolve into a human who fights evil. Wow. A human who fights evil. That'd be pretty cool. You become human, Nushi. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You said okay. you saw it. I don't see anything. Yes, turn around. Alright, we're turning around. We're going west now. West. It's gonna be an island right in front of you. Oh my god, there yep, it is. There it's it is, right there. Stonehenge. <laughs> it is Stonehenge, yes. I'd go in here and save it. Um, it's not letting me go in. Where's the entrance? Might be on the other side of the island. Or the I formation. need to go on into Stonehenge. Hold it, can't, ha, can't I? No, it's not letting me go in here either. What? Yeah, there's no... Where's the... An old friend of Nushi. Grrr. Don't be scared. I won't do anything. I won't touch you or nothing. Yes, that's a good boy. You're a smart boy, aren't you? Wowoon! To tell the oh. truth, Nishi, I'm tired. I'm tired of living. That's dark. It is. It's dark. <laughs> that's not something Nishi. people should say, but you know. I think what I'm doing may be wrong. Oh. And now, I've started to think that I can't help but feel there's no meaning to life. Wow. 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 Yes, Genius and Rain and Lloyd. They're all good people. I like them. I'm happy. They made me their friend. But... Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. Forget what I just said now. It wasn't like me. Don't just, be like that guy. Just this guy's a little weird. Alright, you need to make your way in there. I'm trying, but these things are now gonna fight me. And oh my god, what the hell are these things? The big old mantis creatures. Wow, they are creature esque. Creature esque. Yeah, they're very uh -oh. creature esque. No poison. Well, that's all right. He can he can suffer through it. He'll be all right. Dude, <laughs> just warming up. Anti magic an ass. <laughs> Look at that thing. Fucking genius is holding. It's got like lights and shit. Oh it's all yeah. Glowing. Oh my god. It's a fancy ball. It's fancy. It's like a disco ball. It's a disco stick. It's got a party in his Take pants. Take a ride on my di There's no way in here. What the fuck? Where is the entrance to this? There's no entrance. I've touched every side of it. There is no entrance. Okay, what the fuck? <laughs> There's no entrance at all. There has to be because this but, is where you're supposed to be. But there's no entrance. I'm getting the feeling that we're supposed to do something else first. And you're misremembering. Maybe you are? I don't know. Oh I thought my that was God, supposed, to be I... supposed to do. Did you not play this part yet? You haven't played this part yet, have you? Yes, I have. Okay, then <laughs> I, I'm really confused then. Maybe you are supposed to go to Altamira first. Go to Altamira. Oh my God. <laughs> we're going to go to Altamira. In the next episode. God, what the fuck, dude? <laughs> Until then, everybody. This is where you're supposed to be. I, I know this is where you're supposed to be. She's been an extremely lost and confused Zelos 1826. <laughs> We're gonna let her have a little bit of time to regain her composure and her sense of direction. 
What and sense then, of direction? I have none. I don't know. Maybe I'll get you some for Christmas next year. I'm putting it on the list. <laughs> Until then, everybody. I'm going to first cure this poison before I forget it. What cures poison? I'm not here anymore. She's not here anymore. Uh, a special poison that can transform. No. Uh, Rosemary. No. Panaka. There we go. Panaka. Panaka. He's been Panakaed. I've been Cow's Crazy. She's been Zellos. Please subscribe. Please leave a comment below. And of course. <laughs>